immigration, war on terror, how do those things connect and what is your plan to, about what to do about it? Everyone here knows this is a very hot topic. And uh, what troubles me about it is I see politicians uh, manipulating it, manipulating it to help themselves. And I, all I know how to do about this is what I believe is right. So I'll tell you exactly what I think is right. Three things. One, I do think our southern border is a mess. And I think we can't sustain what's happening there. It's got to be fixed. I would put more money, more people, more technology, and use these unmanned drones to monitor the border that are not being used today. <coughs> Excuse me. I also, I'm not for building a fence all the way across our southern border. I think that's crazy. But, but I do think there might be isolated places that some fencing actually might do some good. And I'd be willing to do that. Second, I would crack down on employers that are knowingly violating the law. And in many cases, abusing the workers. Now, the more controversial thing is I don't believe that we should have a country made up of first-class citizens and second-class workers, which is what I see happening today. And so I think there's, I'm not for amnesty, but I do think there should be a path to earn citizenship. And I would have a couple of requirements. One of them is not very controversial. The other one is. The first requirement is I would make them pay a fine. They came here illegally. We're a law-abiding country. No, the fine just can't be so high that it can't be paid. Oh, I don't agree with that. I, God bless you, but I don't agree with that. Uh, well, we just disagree. You're allowed to disagree with me. Uh, I suspect there are other people here who disagree with some things I've said. Uh, now, I'm not for the kind of fine we saw going through the Congress, which could be like $10,000. None of these people, they're never going to be able to pay, working people pay $10,000. But I would, I, I think paying, you've got to do something. You can't just treat it like they didn't come here illegally and nothing happened. I mean, I think there has to be a recognition for that. I would have the fine low enough that they could actually pay it but I would require them to pay a fine. The second thing is I think they should learn to speak English. If they want to become American citizens, they should learn to speak English. We should help them with that. Who's next? Uh,